Good morning, everyone. Dr. C here coming at you live from Phoenix, Arizona. As most of you know, I'm out of town for the weekends. I am here for a chiropractic seminar and the presenter posed an interesting question yesterday because we're all chiropractors in the room, but we all practice a little bit differently as well. And so he asked us, what's one question that you get a lot in your practice? And the more I thought about it, the common denominator that I get a lot in practice is what can I do at home to help support what we're doing here in the office? And a lot of times the recommendations that I give for people to do at home is gonna be some stretches, a little bit of corrective exercise, but more than anything, it's just some what we call mobility work. So working on getting things loosened up a little bit, you know, we all sit so much these days between driving, working, school, everything requires us to sit and we're not designed to sit. And so unfortunately that causes a lot of problems in our bodies and um, just kind of addressing this issue in addition to the chiropractic component that we do in the office can really help people to support their adjustments in between appointments. So a great example of this is I recently had a new patient and I would say most of my patients are adult age, but this new patient is actually a child and she's only 10 years old and her parents were bringing her in because she pretty much has pain all over and which is pretty rare for a child. You know, they're young, they're flexible, they shouldn't be having these issues so young in life, especially not so many issues without any kind of injury or trauma. So as I went through my examination, I just realized that everything is so tight. And she's never been to a chiropractor before, so the chiropractic adjustment obviously helped a lot, but I gave her a ton of mobility care and stretches to do at home in between appointments. So she's homeschooled, so she's sitting down, listening to her mom give the lessons, and then studying and doing homework, and she's sitting for a very good portion of her day. And of course, she's a child, and that generation, they're on their phones all the time, so constantly down like this, looking at a screen, which is just going to contrib contribute to her symptoms. So um, they came back for a follow-up visit uh, about, <clears throat> excuse me, about 10 days later, and all I had given her to do was stretches and mobility work at home. And when they came in for the follow-up visit, I asked the child, oh, so how, how are you doing? How are you feeling? And she said that she's feeling so much better. So just that little change of incorporating a little bit of mobility work into your day can really help reverse some of the effects that we experience from sitting all day. So just getting some movement and mobility work into your life is a great thing for everybody. Everyone will benefit from it. So I just wanted to see, engage some interest to see if anyone be, would be interested in um, attending a mobility workshop. If I were to host a mobility workshop for my patients or your friends, family, really anyone in the local area, uh, if anyone has any interest in attending something like that. So let me know, drop a, a comment down below or send me a private message or you can call the office at 727-241-9095. Any of these options are ways to get in touch with me. Uh, you can also send me an email address at info at clearwaterchiroclinic.com. So whichever option you prefer, go ahead and get in contact with me and let me know if you're interested in attending a workshop like that. So that way we can get it in the works. So thanks so, so much for your time, everyone. I hope everyone's having a great weekend and we'll see you next week.